that's right, it's me, Uncle Lou, live for you on YouTube. Uh, yep, I have to be. Thanks for watching. Uh, well, the Georgia-Carolina game has officially been moved to Sunday at 2.30. Most of you uh, have already heard about that by now, I'm sure. They announced that um, late yesterday afternoon, early evening. So Sunday at 2.30 uh, in Columbia, uh, williams Rice Trailer Park. Game's been moved, which is more than I can say for Florida and LSU. Florida, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. I, I should probably just make a separate video on, on Florida and the way they handled this LSU situation, trying to chicken their way out of a game so they'll have an additional way to back themselves into the SEC championship game. But if, if you want me to make a separate video on that, let me know down below and I will. This is going to be about Carolina. All I'm hearing... From Carolina and the Gamecock fans, oh, UGA, you lost three in a row, Willie B. You, you, you lost three in a row, Willie B. You, you, like me, you, Willie B. How many players are on Carolina's team right now that were on Carolina's team the last time we we lost a hey, Willie B, or the time before that, or the time before that? That doesn't matter. It had nothing to do with the game being a hey, Willie B. Nothing. It had everything to do with South Carolina being in the middle of its greatest run in school history, which resulted in nothing. Nothing. Your biggest accomplishment during your greatest run in school history was three home wins in the regular season over UGA. Um, congrats. I mean, what, what do you want me to say? I mean, what, what, I don't. What do you want me to say? Well, you don't. You don't. Let's talk about now. Oh, you want to three in a row? Willie, really? let's talk about right now. Right now, who's on your team right now? From last year and this year, a team last year. Somebody's calling me now. I had to do that. A, a team right now. There was three. In nine last year, with a loss to the Citadel. You have two SEC wins in the last two years. They're both over Vanderbilt. UGA is 48 and 18 against you. You would have to win the next 30 games straight. You would have to beat UGA 30 years in a row to even tie the series. You're a joke. An absolute joke of a program. Just terrible. Uh, they do three in a row with Willie B. No one cares. I promise you no one on Georgia's team right now cares. I promise you. No one on your team cares or probably even knows. Your head coach works for UGA. You're not winning. Will Muschamp has worked for UGA since he graduated. We send him around from school to school to ruin him. We send him to Florida, ruin Florida. Send him to Auburn, ruin Auburn. I mean, you guys were already ruined. This is just throwing salt in the wound. Here you go. Hey, I got an idea. Hey, come here, come here, come here, come here. You know how South Carolina went three and nine last year and lost to the Citadel? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Guess what we're going to do? <laughs> Hold on. We're going to give them Will Muschamp. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Hey, three and nine. And, 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 and let's be real, you're not making a bowl game this year. You're not beating UGA. You're not beating Tennessee. You're not beating Florida. You're not beating Missouri. I mean, what, what really are you, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? <laughs> I mean, look, the best, here's the, here's the only good news. The only good news for the state of South Carolina. It's going to be pouring down rain all weekend there. So, that may dampen some of the post-game festivities after UJ beats the brakes off you. You know, usually these guys up in Columbia, all over South Carolina, these little podump hick towns, dirt roads, South Carolina, usually want, you know, anytime South Carolina loses the game, for <coughs> still a little sick. <coughs> First thing they want to do when the game's over, <coughs> damn it, 
Good morning. First thing they want to do when the game's over, run out their trailer, set all their wheelbarrow tires on fire, burn piles of wood and crap like that. All this rain, everything's going to be soaking wet, so they might not be able to do that, which is going to put a damper on their post-game match. <laughs> anyway, look, Sacramento's not winning this game. I'm sorry. Your rush defense is terrible, um, and this is probably going to be a ground game. Uh, it's going to be wet. Our players can't catch the ball when it's dry, so I don't think we're going to be throwing the ball much in this game if it's wet. Uh, we have three running backs in the top 25 in the SEC in rushing. You have one, uh, and he's like 17th or 18th. So you just don't stand a chance here. We have a better ground game than you, and we're better against the run than you. You're terrible against the run. Uh, you can't throw the ball either. Um, you, you guys are just terrible, and you have no chance. I, mean, I don't know what else to tell you. I do hope you're all still safe, though. Remember, this is just entertainment. Don't take it personally. Uh, the storm is more serious than anything I say here on YouTube. I hope everybody stays safe. I uh, hope your family's safe, your house, your property, all that stuff. Uh, Injury-free game, but the dogs are going to humiliate you because your football team is just a friggin' joke. That's just all there is to it. But have a great day and a good morning if you can.